guys you are new here my name is peace aka miss preppy pearl and i am back i don't know if i'm officially back but i'm back i know it's been a minute since i've been on here been just trying to get my life together but we are back and i'm here with new content so what i'm going to be doing over the next few weeks i'm going to be sharing basically like a kind of like skincare haul um and it's going to be broken up into three or four parts i haven't yet decided but today you guys are going to be watching my skincare haul of all my different types of cleansers if you've been following me on ig you've been noticing that i've posted like different clips of skincare products that I've been sent and whatnot. So I really want to go into detail with this series about the different products and basically just show you the products and just talk a little bit about them. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. I hope you guys enjoy. But before you, you know, you continue, please go ahead, like, subscribe, you know, the deed for me, okay? I really want to grow the family. So yeah, Let's go ahead and get into it. So as you all know, cleansing is the first step in like skincare. Actually, that's what everyone should start with. You need to cleanse your face before you start using like serums and other stuff. So we're starting off with the cleansers. First up, I got the Good Molecule Rose Water Daily Cleansing Gel. If you actually go and search it on their website, it's now called the Hydrating Facial Cleansing Gel. But as you can see, the girl has used it all up. And I'm starting off with this because this is my most used and I would say my favorite cleanser right now. For starters, the retail price for it is $12. So that's one of the reasons I actually do love Good Molecules in general because they specialize in producing like good products but in a reasonable price range which I just absolutely love. Also, the good thing about Good Molecules too is that you can also get them on like a subscription. So they have like a two pack and a three pack and also you can do it on a subscription basis. So I think you get some percentage off as well when you do it that way. But the reason I love this cleanser, for starters, it's a daily cleanser. So if you're looking for something you can use all the time, this is it. Also, if you're familiar with like the benefits of rose water, so rose water helps with like dryness and also like itchiness. It's also kind of like like a has like a soothing effect on your skin i personally noticed as soon as i started using this i think within like maybe a week or two like i would say like the inflammation parts of my skin definitely calmed down so that's why i like them and also it's very effective the thing with good molecules i will say though is that you have to use it for i would say a prolonged time in order to really see the benefits it's not one of those things that you just start and then like oh you start seeing the the results immediately i it's not one of those but i love it because once you start seeing the benefits the benefits are there of course like rose water has other important benefits i'm just gonna like pop them here on the screen but i love this cleanser also because it's a foaming cleanser so all you have to do is basically like wet your face and wet the product and then just put it into a lather and it basically suds up so you have like a nice little bubble experience all over your face also it doesn't irritate your eyes which um me i have sensitive eyes so whenever i use things such as like cleansers some things react with my eyes some don't a lot of times a things do react but this doesn't so if you have sensitive skin sensitive eyes whatever it may be this is the product for you so definitely recommend it i honestly recommend all of good molecules and you know and all the other series that i'm going to be doing i'm going to tell you guys about the other products by good molecules but since we're on cleansers in this video this is definitely a wonderful cleanser and like i said it's pretty affordable so if you're just starting to get into skincare or you need something that's effective but not too much money then i would recommend this in their sites so i'm gonna be looking here it's basically suitable for all skin types um that's what they claim and then it targets dullness impurities and dehydration so like i said it, rose water usually is for like dryness and itchiness so that makes sense also it's rich in antioxidants so it soothes the skin helps maintain a bright tone and that is so true because like after two weeks i noticed the difference in my skin tone being brighter so i definitely believe that it does that and then it also has like a pineapple extract so you know pineapple helps with exfoliation and also brightening so yeah i I love this as you can see it's empty so i have to like get a new one like i literally finished it yesterday and i was so upset like bro what do you mean i'm done i should have paid more attention but maybe because like i have so many other like cleansers i'm like 
I'll get around to it. But yeah, I definitely recommend this. So next up, we have the Solo Biome Hydrating Gel Cleanser by Solo Wave. So I just started using this, but so far so good. It kind of reminds me of the Good Molecules Gel Cleanser. It's basically kind of like the same kind of consistency, gel-like in a sense. It's also very lightweight, so if you don't like heavy things on your skin, this definitely is lightweight on your skin. So what it's meant for, it's meant to cleanse and restore and basically help your natural skin barrier. So that is what they claim and that is what it does. And so far, I think it's doing that. I like it so far just because it's like light and it's, you know, consistent. It's a gel type product. Gels usually work better on my skin type. So yeah, definitely like that about them. So this retails for about $24. But right now, because, you know, it's the month of love, they are having a sale right now. So you might want to use their code to get some money off of this it's basically meant to hydrate your skin and also gently sweep away like makeup dirt all the other like impurities of your skin so i actually want to tell you guys like what type of ingredients are in it so i'm gonna be reading so just <laughs> so it's like cruelty free gluten free vegan so all those things there it's basically made from like pre and probiotics first ingredient that's in it that helps with that is the lactobacillus ver ferment lyosate i hope i pronounced that right so basically it's a powerful probiotic that has a regulating effect on the immune system as it pertains to the skin health appearance and regenerative capabilities so there's that two is beta glucon um, which is naturally derived from a mushroom so um, it's a prebiotic that soothes, nourishes, and boosts skin moisture levels. And then lastly, Sparasis crispa extract, and it's a cauliflower mushroom. And basically, it just prepares the skin to drink in and retain as much moisture as possible. So far, with the two cleansers I've just mentioned, I think they're definitely made for people who suffer with dry skin. But... I'm an oily skin person and I've been using it and I'm not experiencing excessive skin like besides just a natural glow. So I like it. I do think it's nice. Also, um, if you missed the discount code for this month, I do have a discount code because I am an affiliate with them. So I'll put that in the description below for you guys to use as well. But yeah, and just like the other product, how you use it, you basically just, you know, wet your hands. And you work this into like a silky lather. It's not as lathery as good molecules, but there is a lather that happens. And you don't need that much. So just keep that in mind. But yeah, that's the second one that I would recommend part of my haul. I guess I'm just going in order of like price or whatever. Here I have the Soam Institute. Yeah, there's not really anything to see. It's just literally like a blue dot. They packaging it's basically just like a white base container and then some dot that indicates what it's for so yeah this is the cleanser and i would say this cleanser is now getting into like the more treatment type cleansers i personally don't use this daily i only use this when i'm like having like flare-ups with acne or i'm going through hormonal issues because it definitely helps to counteract the effects of that. So this is what I use. Also, I like the Soma Institute. Out of all of the cleansers I talk about today, the Soma Institute is the one that they really educate you and tell you everything about their products. But that makes sense because they are actually a research institute. And me as a researcher, I really appreciate that because I like when I know what is in my products, even though with all my products, I always go through the research <laughs> of figuring out what it is because, again, I'm trying to keep my face together. You know, like, this face is expensive, so we can't be just putting anything on there. But I love how with them, you don't have to go through, like, the extra steps of figuring out this ingredient, this ingredient. They basically just explain it to you full on. Also, with this cleanser, I would say this cleanser works best with some Institute's other products that you use. So this i would say if you're going to use this also buy the other things because it definitely works together better i see the effects of it better that way but again this is more of for me a treatment cleanser when i need like a little bit more and this retails for 48 dollars, so it's a bit more expensive i would say but i will say that for 48 dollars it just depends like if you're really suffering maybe you want to try this but i 
do think that there's other cleansers that will work that also treat and are just not as expensive but i do like it and also you get a good bit that's the other reason why i like it compared to all the other cleansers you get a lot for your money that's why it kind of it kind of sets it off in that sense but yeah their products are also made with a dispersion type technology my camera died so i'm using my phone now so if y'all see like a change or a shift that's what happened but anyway as i was saying so some institute's products usually are made with some type of dispersion type technology and so basically what that means is that it just disperses um vitamin deeply into the skin um if you want to learn more about what that is you can just go and look at their website which i'll provide in the description but yeah i definitely love the technology behind it i love the research that goes into it and also it's a non-fragrance Oh, I forgot. Like, I didn't even mention that with all the other ones. So with the Good Molecules, Good Molecules cleanser, it doesn't really smell like anything, even though it's supposed to be like rose. It doesn't really give me rose, but there is like floral notes in it, but it's pretty much clean. Then with the Solo Biome cleanser, it gives, it doesn't have any scent either. It's fragrance free. And then with this cleanser this cleanser is also fragrance free there's no like harsh chemicals they basically just make it and that is it like there's nothing more to it and this is not a lather type cleanser this is more of a silk type cleanser it's not meant to be bubbly and all that like fanfare and everything it's just simply like you wet your skin you put it on your skin and you you know circular motions and that's it and you cleanse it off so that's what it is with that and now finally last but not least we have the tracy martin amla purifying cleanser this is how it looks but yeah this cleanser i absolutely love this cleanser i absolutely love this cleanser but i will say it retails for 68 dollars so just keep that in mind but i also have a discount code for this so i'll be dropping that also in the description so you can you know get some money off but this cleanser definitely has a scent it's it gives me tropical slash citrusy which makes sense because it has like pineapple extract in it but this cleanser is amazing like amazing i only really use it in the night but you can use it both in the am and pm but reason i only use it at night is because i feel like it's more active and i don't want it to react with the sun so that's why i use it at night also i use it with another product of tracy martin's which is a mask which helps with the impurities and whatnot and i think they combine perfectly together like i absolutely love this like i said the price retails for 68 dollars which i won't lie is a bit much for me just because of you see how small this is yeah it's just yeah like <laughs> I think I need a little bit more, but this is like a more luxury item. This cleanser is actually described as liquid gold, so it definitely lives up to its name. But the key benefits of this cleanser is that it brightens, it gently exfoliates, it promotes an even skin tone, discourages blemishes and breakouts, deep cleanses without stripping the skin, and pH balance. And I would say that this cleanser, out of all the cleansers, when I have a like acne breakout or something along those lines this will definitely get me together which is why i love it and that's typically when i only really use it so i do like it for that so the key active ingredients because i like discussing that is the amla which is indian gooseberry and basically it's a concentrated source of vitamin c um, and it also has anti-aging properties so yeah then it also has hawaiian green papaya enzymes so basically it's a natural enzyme from papayas that exfoliates dead skin leaves your skin smooth and bright and then finally it has lactic acid which is basically suitable for like sensitive skin and it basically just and it basically just breaks down dead skin cells without causing irritation so it definitely helps even skin tone and improve like the texture but i will say that out of all the cleansers here this cleanser you might feel some tingling with it i think it just depends you just gotta test it out if it'll work for your skin or not it does work for my skin and i love it like i said it definitely helps brighten helps with breakouts and whatnot but yeah in regards to the price if you want to subscription service with them it also reduces the price of it as well so that's something to keep in mind also with this cleanser it's 
more of a silky finish. It doesn't really lather. Like it does lather. It does lather a little bit actually. But it's not like a foamy type lathering. It's more of a suddy. Well, foam, sud, they're basically the same, right? Well, either way, it's not as it's not gonna give you all the sud and like uh, foam effect but it definitely does get a little you know um sudy and whatnot so I definitely do like that and so also what I love about this cleanser and compared to all the cleansers I've mentioned is that it removes your makeup like this is this is the cleanser you use when you don't feel like double cleansing yeah definitely use this cleanser so it's kind of worth it for that it acts as both a cleanser and also a makeup remover so you know that's something to consider so those are the four cleansers that i wanted to share with you guys today i hope you guys enjoyed this nice skincare haul so part two we're going to be going into the serums and toner i would say we're going to be going into the serums but yeah that is basically it for me if you have any other questions just you know drop a comment and i'll answer them as best as i can and again everything that i um, talked about i'll drop the links and the discount codes and everything in the description for you guys to purchase on your own and just let me know what you think if you end up using them let me know what you think and yeah so that is it for me thank you so much for watching for coming to the end and watching i hope you enjoy and i'll see you guys in part two Bye.